Hi boys and girls, it's Miss Reynolds with Bored, Better Off Reading Every Day. Today, we have two really, really awesome books for you because we are feeling like we should be flying and flying high, high up in the sky. Oh yes, oh yes. It is about wings, super wings. And these two books are about super wings. You guessed it, the ones that fly in the sky. Now, you know Miss Reynolds needs her glasses to really read. Those are just for fun. Those are flying glasses. Our first book is Super Wings Lost Stars. And our second book is Super Wings, A Super First Day. And of course, we wanna start off by revving, revving up our plane. <laughs> you like that? All right, let's get this started. They're all revved up and ready to go. A super first day. I am Jet. Sometimes I'm a plane and sometimes I'm a robot. I take boxes across the world. This box is going to Kenya. It's the first day of school for a little boy in Kenya, but his backpack has a hole. I'm Jet, I say. I'm on time every time. This box is for you. Thanks, Jet, the boy says. Now, let's go to school. We walk to school. We see many animals. Look, I say. That giraffe is stuck. We work together. We help save the giraffe. Great work. Plop, plop. Oh no, it starts to rain. The river starts to flood. We are stuck, the boy says. We need to save the animals and I need to get to school. I call Donnie and his friends. They come to save the day. I know we can make a boat all aboard. We did it, the boy says. We saved the animal, but now I'm late for school. Don't worry, I say, this can be a speed boat. It's working, the boy says, but we are going too fast. Remy comes to the rescue. She uses her hook. She catches us just in time. The boy makes it to school.
Bye, the boy says. Thank you, Super Wings. The end, boys and girls, of Super Wings, a super first day. That's the first one. I don't know if it'll stay up, but we'll try. The second one is Lost Stars. Hi, I'm Jet. Sometimes I'm a plane, sometimes I'm a robot. I take boxes across the world. This box is going to Italy. I'm Jet, I say. I'm on time every time. This box is for you. Thank you, the girl says. Now I can look at the stars all the time. Look, the girl says, stars tell a story. Do you see the circle? The circle is part of this story, the girl says. It's getting dark outside. Come on, the girl says, I'll show you. Oh no, the circle is missing. I call Astra and her friends. They are spaceships. They can find the lost stars. Hop in, I say. I call Astra and her friends. They are spaceships. They can find the lost stars. Hop in, I say. We fly up, up, up. It's trash, the girl says. Trash is in front of the stars. That's why we can't see the circle of stars. We see a spaceship, Nimbus Ned, the ship says, ready to clean, but look, my bag broke. We see a spaceship, Nimbus Ned, the ship says, ready to clean, but look, my bag broke. Don't worry, Astra says. We can help. Astra and her friends clean up the junk. Don't worry, Astra says. We can help. Astra and her friends clean up the junk. The trash is gone. We can see the stars again. We did it, the girl says. The girl smiles. We saved the day, she says. No, I say, we saved the stars. The girl smiles. We saved the day, she says. No, I say, we saved the stars. Super wings, save the stars. The end of Lost Stars. Now, boys and girls, these are I Can Read books. And I choose a lot of these books, the Shared My First Reading books, because when you guys are learning how to read, these are easy for you to learn how to read and read along. And on the back, I'll tell you what it says. 
When a constellation vanishes, a trip into space with the super wings is the only way to fix it. And it says, my first basic language, word repetition, and whimsical illustrations, ideal for sharing with your emerging reader. Simple sentences for eager new readers, engaging stories for developing readers, and complex plots for confident readers. Boys and girls, you may not know what any of that means. Your parents do, though. And these books are great when you're starting to read and practicing your reading, which you know I love to do. It is Miss Reynolds with Board, Better Off Reading Every Day. It's been my pleasure to bring these two Super Wings books to you and to show off this beautiful plane right here with these beautiful wings. This was loaned to me by one of my lovies who absolutely loves Super Wings and loves watching it, loves planes, loves anything having to do with flying. He is a super little boy and I thank him for loaning me this awesome, awesome plane. Look at this thing. It is amazing. Boys and girls, I am very lucky that I am able to have lots of friends like you, lots of lovies, who not only loan me books sometimes, your favorite books, these happen to be mine, I own these, but you also learn me, learn me. <laughs> you also loan me your super awesome toys. Look at this thing. And it was loaned to me, so I'm super lucky, and I want to say thank you to any of you guys who've been loaning me your toys and letting me share in the joy of what it is that brings you so much joy. Because as you know, right here is where I do my storytelling magic, where I become the book. And what better way to become the book than to be completely decked out in flight in wings, in everything having to do with flying. So what are we gonna do? Our own version of flying, we're gonna do our board twirl. But first, I wanna show you how this works. Ready? Let me get it up in front so you can see it. Don't want my glasses to fall off. I want to be able to see you. Ready? Better off reading every day. Storytelling magic, bored with Miss Reynolds. No, we're not leaving yet. We're gonna do our board twirl. You ready? Here we go. Now, we're gonna go. Take us out of here.